All right, this is Undiluted Tech, and today we are looking at the Predator OS. This is a past initial review since this operating system is in its infancy. So we're just gonna do um, just a quick review, uh, an installation, and see what tools come with it. This is geared up towards people who are ethical hackers. You can also use it for as a security operating system like tails and cubes as well so let's go ahead and see what um this has to offer first we're looking at the installation page or the uh, the website so looking at it we have uh predator os modes i believe it has nine modes as you can see uh we're gonna start with um before we get to the operating modes we're gonna start with the specification now it's based off of ubuntu mini uh, 20.04 LTS uh, it's currently running kernel 5.5.10 um, the current one I believe is 5.10 but no nah, doesn't matter um, the origin is emperoros.com team I have to check those guys out um, so the default and the only available desktop it's XFC as of now so yeah, as you can see they're coming soon KDE plasma and mate should be following uh, that's at the developer's discretion, so I don't know when that will happen. And uh, as you can see, it's geared to pen testing, security, privacy, forensics. Uh, uh, anyways, the requirements, you have to have at least 26 gigabits of hard drive space for installation. So if you have less than that, it's not going to install for you. Uh, minimum of 2 GB of RAM. Uh, a USB stick or DVD stick if you still use DVDs and a minimum of Intel Core i3 or AMD E1 processors. This is a really, um, given that it's Linux, it doesn't, you know, use old hardware, which, you know, I don't know why, but if you're in a third world country or somewhere you don't have access to i3, then uh, how do you run this thing so i mean i it's not a big deal people now you know they got some money in their pockets so they can afford beefy machines Okay, um, update standard folders to current language. I've never seen this before, but um, the complete language support, okay. So this option, I guess. Alright, so what now? Uh, close that. Close that. Um, update names, yeah. Last thing I like to do. Let's get on the command line. Uh, let's view here exclusively. Ah, uh, I still believe, can't believe this thing didn't pick up uh, VMware tools. Do we have any packages to update? Sudo apt update. Let's run some updates, see what it picks up. Um, well, that's doing updates. You can explore 
the operating system itself. So there's an app launcher. Let's start with that. Uh, that takes you to what? Command line? Uh, now remember the command they suggested that we should run once we say low profile. What was it? Export. It was export. Uh, let me check that up. Uh, give me one second. Let's I mean patient. Okay, so export. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. All right. So that's done. So we won't see that again. So let's do the app launcher again. Yeah, still there. Anyways, you can figure that one on your own. Um, so press F1 to bring back the terminal over all open windows. Uh, yeah, we can explore that later. So there is a post installation PDF, which is good. Um, that gives you the same information. Uh, essential tools. Is it not launcher? Okay. Well. Since I just want to be fast, let's go to install recommended tools. Okay, here we go. Okay, installing tools. Uh, what tools have been installed? Arduino, Android Studio IDE, Indra, I think that's how you say Visual Code, and Mobile Security Framework. Okay. Uh, recommended tools, operation, near operation expert. Anyway, I don't know this stuff. If you figure out how to do this, let me know. But let's go to, let's explore this thing. Um, top tools, essential tools. So we got Bleach It, so if you want to clean your disks, that's good. I don't know what Catfish does. Uh, there's uh, IDE, Genie, uh, Software Updater, Stacer, I'm glad. C. Stacer says, well, who has been using my CPU processes? So that's good, it comes with Stacer. Alright, that's one too. Um, what else? So, Naptic package, and I guess this is a terminal, Tilix, and then they got Uku kernel updater. So, if you want to update your kernel, you can use Uku. That's good, so you don't have to go out there and um, try to do this on your own about special tools i bet these are for the ethical hackers again they got gihindra or hindra i don't know how you say they got aircrack uh armitage uh Armageddon, go buster johnny the reaper for passwords hash um baltego for reconcerns nmap oph crack oph crack oh that's awesome SQL map, Wireshark, yes, I don't know what these tools do, but anyway, I thought it was good just to go see what they offer, all right? So my Stacey, why not, it's consuming half <laughs> my message. The memory, oh, the memory is doing good, okay. Oh, you wanna tell me, maybe I'm reading this wrong. Let me see if I can fix this. It, um, just one second. There we go. Much better. We go to. We'll see. You. All right. Now this is way better than what we were seeing before. Wait a second. What is this? There's a terminal right here. Okay. Okay. We just exit from there. This is much better. So let's go back to app launcher. Again, that's failed. Uh, tools uh, we give you this one more try i don't know why it keeps failing okay so we'll do Arduino. oh so you have to select one and then it goes ahead and installs okay well that's good all right one well, i was doing that that we looked at the post -it to installation doc let's take a look at that we got the trash, press F1 to bring it to the background. Oh, let's see, F1. 
Okay, well, I brought something else. F1. Was it F1? Yeah, F1. Okay, apparently, maybe my virtual machine is messed up. But, anyways, okay. I don't want to install anything else. Stay, sir. What is it doing? Okay, let's take a look at what the CPU is pretty high usage. As expected, it's a virtual machine and it's sharing. Um, so memory seems okay. Uh, I see why they wanted you to have at least 26 gigabits of disk because it's using up what 22 out of 28. That's something. And here is a kernel. GPU integration required. Did I do not? Okay, what the heck? I, I'm gonna ignore this. Um, this is cancel, 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 cancel. Okay. Yes, for that. Yes, quit. Too many terminals going on here. Uh, one sixty-three percent. Packages can be upgraded, so we just put the vision just upgrade and let the broken packages. What? Uh, okay. Uh, anyways, that is something I can deal with later. It's again, I'm just trying this to see. What's going on. So, what is this XF? Mouse pad. Uh, let's back to the browser. Let's see what comes with uh, privacy badger. What are the extension? Duck, duck, go privacy essentials. Okay. Uh, I don't know why they have Google Translate. If <laughs> if you're trying to be private, why would you use Google? Anyways, that's just me. Hacking tools. What do we have here? This. Nothing. All right, anyways, let's get out of that. Um, what else? Let's see. How do you? There's a search menu here. Okay, you can search whatever you need, and then here's about Predator OS installing Predator tutorial mode, defensive mode. What does this do? Oh, it gives you the tools. Oh. Okay, security mode. This, it's, it's awesome, guys. I mean, I, I don't know anything about hacking and stuff, but cryptography, what's under there? Brute force. Encryption part, test SSL. Basically, this is, this is a good, good hacking. It's, to me, it's better than um, Pirate. If you've ever checked out Pirate. Offensive mode. I like that you can use these modes, right? You can switch them and then you get emergency to repair. That's what I thought. Okay, monitoring mode. Okay, if you want to monitor your CPU. Sure, hard disk, real-time monitoring. Cheap parted, um, all that good stuff. Then you get your settings. That's, oh, that's cool. So what's under the menu? Yes, this is the menu, right? Oh, the clicks, okay. Oh, same thing as we saw over there. Um, there is a tutorial mode. Linux commands, what? Are you kidding me? Okay, ready to go. Let's do this again. Tutorial mode, Linux commands. Okay, if you get that working, let me know. Security checklist. Why is this not starting up? What am I doing wrong? Comment over there if I'm doing something wrong. Cheat sheets. All right. Okay. Oh, stupid thing is taking forever. Oh, we've already looked at these. Predator eyes. Gosh, let's see. Predator eyes coming soon. Okay, so this is a coming soon feature. I would like to see what this is. Oh, man, guys, I love this operating system so far. And I like it's already dark mode, so I don't have to change a lot of stuff. Icons, mm, I could use a little color change. 
But this is Linux Stitch Master. What are those? Vagrant, Shebang. Ah. Okay. As a quick reference. Ah. Now, let's see. Oops. 200. 300%. Okay. Look at this. It gives you a cheat sheet. Uh, this, you know, I, I wish all operating systems or Linux operating system did this, because there's a lot of people who don't know how to use Linux or what commands to run. But I'm finding this very, very helpful. They got the Unix command as well. Huh? It's, actually, it's this is good. This is good. Um, uh, so far, so good. So, what else? Did this finish installing? That's to gain all that stuff in it. Let's just close all these. Uh, this is a, a emulator with the timing up. Okay. All right. So, what is this then? XFC terminal. the browser and minimize all windows so all windows okay I need places all tools we've seen all these a menu we've seen all that mm, oh you launcher it comes up with you, you let's see if it tries this control space and it works okay so you can actually search uh, let's say stacer yeah Ooh, and also it comes with what? Sync thing? No way. Okay, let me see. How do you get over the menu? Let's see. Okay, I'm a gnome guy. So I how do you get all I don't use XFC. Who out there can help me to get this? You know You know like when you go into GNOME you can see all your You know what I mean? Like all your applications. Uh, okay, anyways, whoever, I hope he makes one with GNOME for the sake of those guys who are still stuck in the old days of GNOME. But this is it, man. Uh, I hope all you are healthy. And may Yeshua bless you. Peace out.